And that is why school cafeterias should provide outdoor dining when mac and glue ugh, is being served. Thank you. Thank you, Ava. I know you will bring our school to victory at the debate tournament this weekend. I roll. <laughs> <laughs> Alyssa, I believe your oral report is overdue. Oh, yeah, it's not ready yet. I'm still editing. You mean you haven't written anything? Shut up. Share what you have. I mean, personally, I'd love to hear about more debates. No. no. Okay, fine. Here it goes. The Crucible, Witchcraft, Salem. Oh, Massachusetts. Been there once. Traffic is terrible. Worse than California. Oh, and there's a lingering scent of fish. Thank you. Alyssa, you haven't finished the book, have you? I mean, it's just like so hard to get into. Is it a book? Is it a play? Is it good? I just have all these questions. I'll extend your report until Monday. But you must pass the test today with a C or higher. But D's get degrees. You need a C to keep your average up. Ava. Ava. Earth to Ava. What? Did you want me to proof your history report? Oh, yes. Here. Is everything OK? Sophia, do you ever wish we were popular? I'm popular with the right crowd. You know what I mean. No, I don't. Honestly, I don't really care. You don't ever think about it? You don't ever wish people would <laughs> Losers. Treat us like second class citizens? They're just dumb. All of them. Would you like to be dumb? No, but... Ava, we're our own kind of cool. We're smart, and we study hard, and we get good grades, and we have a fear of authority. There's nothing wrong with that. I guess I just wish that we could have one day without people making fun of us, or me having to defend my intelligence. People who make fun of us for our intellect are either ignorant, jealous, or both. I don't think anyone's jealous of us. Why not? They should be. We rock. Hey, um, how many few people are tomorrow night before the end of the school dance? You all in? You know it. Wouldn't miss it. Alyssa? <sighs> She's probably too busy stalking her freak sister anyway. Oh, did you come over here to harass me or ask me out? <laughs> come on. We all know you've been like obsessed with me since like the third grade. I wasn't even going to ask you anyway. Okay. See your house tomorrow night. <laughs> wow, Alyssa, you almost made him cry. <laughs> Serves him right. Anyway, I think that we should all plan to match for the dance. Ooh, we should do pastels. Alyssa, are oh. you even here? Yeah, pastels sound great. Something on your mind? Um, do you guys just ever wonder what life would be like if we weren't popular? If we were like... Like Ava? My mom says you shouldn't think about things you don't want. You'll, like, draw them into your life or something. No way. Seriously, it's true. Like, one time I was thinking about a white car, and then I saw one, like, not even two seconds later. Well, half the cars on this planet are white, Julia. Why do you ask? Do you want to be a part of the nerd tribe? Well, no, I just think there's more to life than matching to school outfits, and I don't know, like, hanging out with people we don't even actually like. Are you okay? Like, seriously, I'm worried because we are the most popular girls in school. People want to be us. Well, how is that bad? Yeah, just forget I said anything. I'll see you guys later. Am I wrong? No. I'm a good I don't care about those. So Ava, are you ready for this weekend's debate tournament? Sure am. I got to practice with the mock debate today. It was a little lackluster, if you ask me. Well, this is the week of the final exams. How are you guys feeling? Well, I'm ready. We're supposed to have a lit test tomorrow, but I get to go out of it because of my grades. Sweetheart, that's fantastic. I'm so proud of you. What about you, kiddo? Are we going to get to see your grades go up this semester? Yeah, absolutely. 
By the sounds of your oral report, I'd never guess your grades would be up. Alyssa, what is she talking about? I have no idea. I don't speak freak. No surprise there, you can barely speak English. Hey, don't call your sister a freak and don't make fun of the way your sister speaks. Look, when did you guys get so mean to each other? Your sisters like it or love it. Alyssa, remember what your teacher said? If you don't bring your grades up, you'll have to repeat freshman year. It's either that or summer school, honey. I know, Mom. So that's no phone, no friends during the summer, and no end of school dance this weekend if you don't pass that test tomorrow. Mom, do you understand what you're even saying right now? Uh-oh. <sighs> Whatever. Sorry, sorry. Hey. Hi. Okay, so I have an idea, and I know we're not in the phase of our lives to be happily doing favors for one another, but I'm desperate, and I've decided you're the only one that can help. Stop being so dramatic and just spit it out. I need you to take tomorrow's lit test for me. What? Yes, I mean, I have it all figured out. Tomorrow we'll just swap places. I can do your hair, you can show me how you poorly dress yourself, and then We'll come back home and get back to normal. Alyssa, we're two completely different people. You remember when we tried this in the third grade? It was when we at least dressed alike. I mean, I don't see the problem. We're almost identical. And besides, we never do anything like this. It could be fun. For who? I mean, haven't you ever wondered what it would be like to be me? Please think about the words that just came out of your mouth and rephrase. Have I ever wondered what it would be like to be you? Do you think that highly about yourself? No, you know what I mean. No, I don't, and I'm tired, and this plan is filled with plot holes. Someone is bound to notice. Such as? Well, you wear perfume every day. I can't stand the smell. You can't suck it up for a day. <sighs> Good night, Alyssa. Please, Ava, please, you don't understand. I mean, if it makes you feel any better, I always wonder what it's like to be you. No, you don't. Yes, I do, like every day. And I don't know, it's just hard because I've always been looked at as Alyssa, sister of the smart girl, and from our parents, from teachers, and I've always been compared to you, and I'm not you, I'm just, I'm me. Do they really call you Alyssa's sister of the smart girl? I mean, yeah, I've heard it at least once. I mean, come on. You've never thought about being someone else? I guess sometimes, but this is too risky. We could get in serious trouble. I, I promise, no one's gonna find out. How do you know that? Well, because if we do, then I'll take care of it. I just, I know if I take this test, I'm gonna have to retake freshman year. And I don't know, just please think about it. Please. I'm sorry, I don't think I can do it. What do you want? Come to get your laughs at the dumb sister? So, I thought about what you asked, and... I'll do it, I'll take the test for you. You will? Thank you so much. You're the best. Okay, um, first things first, you gotta fix your hair. What's wrong with my hair? We don't have the time. Okay. Okay, just be cool, act natural. Natural would be me being me. This is not natural. Just act as natural as I am on a daily basis. Not helpful. Just be yourself. Being me. Okay. Shoot, Jasmine and Julie are coming over. Um, we're wearing pastels to the party tomorrow night. Okay. Okay. All right. Hi. Hey, Alyssa. <laughs> hey, Ava. Hey. Hope you all are swell. <laughs> Who talks like that? Seriously, freak. Don't call her a freak. I mean, yeah, what you said, move along. Are you okay? Your energy seems off. I'm great. Why are you talking to Ava? She's my sister. Alyssa, we have a reputation to protect. You said it yourself. She's not one of us. 
I did? Uh-huh. Well, I take it back. She's actually super nice and really cool. And I encourage all of us to be nicer to each other from now on. What is up with her? Her vibe is definitely not the same. Hey, friend. Are you talking to me? Is there someone else here I should be talking to? N no, it's just me, Ava, just hanging out. And it's just me, Sophia, just saying hi to my best friend. Gosh, you're weird. Did your brainless sister get grounded because she has to take freshman year again? I don't have to take... F Alyssa doesn't have to take freshman year over. Why would you think that? You said her grades are so bad, your parents said she'll probably have to take the year again. Well, that's wrong because she's actually super duper smart and super duper ready to ace her lit test today. Super duper, huh? And she's also really nice if you just give her a chance. Since when has she ever given us chances? Well, I can't remember all the time she has, but I'm sure she has. More like never. She hasn't been nice to us since middle school. I'm just, I don't think she realizes that. Doubtful. All right, everyone. Please turn to chapter 18. Oh, Alyssa, I can't do it. Jasmine and Julia are on to me. Okay, Ava, calm down. They started talking to me about the dress and which nail polish I should wear. And then Jack Sims asked me about the party tomorrow night. And I panicked and I said cheese farts. You said what? Ava, stop. You need to calm down. You're just nervous. Come on, we have next period study hall, and then we get to go home, change, and be back into ourselves, and this will all be forgotten. I know, I'm just scared. Well, I am too. Also, why would you tell Sophia that I have to retake freshman year? That's super rude. Also, the use of the word freak and your friend group within my name in it is abhorrent. I have no idea what that means, but yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too. Well, all we have to do is get past these next few hours and we get to go home and go back to normal, so. <sighs> Sounds good. Your clothes are itchy. Well, they aren't. Stop telling me about my own experiences, Alyssa. Well then stop complaining. Everyone, Ava is going to pass out the tests. When you are done, please sit quietly until the bell rings. I need to speak with Principal Myers for a moment, so Ava, I trust you will oversee the class for a moment. Yeah, sure. It'll be a B minus at least. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. You're the best. Alicia and Ava Rosewood, please report to the principal's office immediately. Oh no. Mrs. Hart, Principal Myers. Come in, girls. Have a seat. Is everything all right? Actually, no, Ms. Rosewood. It's not. Ava, we know you pretended to be Alyssa. But I... This is an issue we take very seriously at this high school. Cheating on a final exam can have consequences like suspension and worse. What's, what's worse? I'm afraid I'm forced to take away all your school-related extracurricular activities including the debate tournament and the end of school dance this weekend. Your parents are on their way to have a meeting with the four of us. 
Wait, please don't do this to her. I pressured her into this. I mean, it's, it wasn't even her idea. I, I'm so, I'm so sorry. Unfortunately, Alyssa, Ava made her choice, made her decisions. Now she has to deal with the consequences. Hey. Hi. I'm sorry about the whole test mess and about the debate tournament. I'm sorry about the dance. It's okay. I'll have plenty more when I retake freshman year. But thank you for what you did. You care, and it shows. It was actually kind of fun being you. I'd never do it again, but it was not easy being you. It was pretty difficult being you too, but since we're grounded for the next century, maybe we can try and be friends again. You know, like when we were little? I'd like that. But I love you, but I never want to be you again. <laughs> Took the words right out of my mouth. The grass isn't always greener on the other side. What makes you different makes you you, so embrace it. And even though cheating might seem like a very easy alternative, eventually you're gonna get caught. And honesty is the best policy. See you guys next time. Bye. Bye.